Abide in me, and I in you, as the branch cannot bear fruit of himself, except it abide in the vine. No more can he, except he abide in me. Say, my father, deliver me from the spirit of last minute miracle. In the name of Jesus, my father, deliver me from the spirit of last minute miracle. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, in Jesus' name we pray. Amen. You are welcome to Evangelist Joshua TV, a TV series that will teach you how to interpret your dreams with warfare prayers. Banana. Monkey loves eating banana. Not because banana is sweet, it's because it is one of their favorite fruits. Banana has various and wide nutrients it does in the body. Banana can help can help the male organs of a man. Bananas can help digestion and banana can eliminate ulcer on all kinds of health, health uh, attributes in the body. For the purpose of the broadcast today, we'll be talking about banana, the spiritual meaning behind banana. What effect does it have on man, on a woman? When somebody has a banana dream, is it a good dream or a bad dream? Is it a dream that is very scary or is it a dream that is very emulating? Sit back and let us share this dream together with you. When we are talking about banana in the dream, banana in the dream is uh, it's not so popular among many people today, but once the dream comes or appears, its meaning can be very, very peaceful, and its meaning can also heal some homes. Then the meaning of banana in your dream is in a lighter mood, in a good mood, it represents happiness, it represents fruitfulness, it represents prosperity, it represents righteousness, it represents marital maturity, it represents sexual desire, it represents love and fertility. Then it represents healthy relationship. If you are dreaming about banana, whether you are a man, whether you are a woman, you are dreaming about banana and in very good mood, these are the, some of the things that it represents. But when you wake up from that dream and you feel so bad, you feel so disorganized, you feel as if the, the whole world is against you, this is what might be the negative perspective, the negative effect, the spiritual effect of it. It can also lure you into masturbation. It can also lure you into unwanted pregnancy. And it can also, and, and it can also add, it has the ability to get hooked up with the wrong person then the negative side of banana in your dream also can also represent unstable relationship and unstable marriage. And banana dream can also, in some cases, be connected to adultery, adultery and fornication. When a man eats banana in the dream, and when he wakes up and begins to have erection, that's to tell you that the man is desiring for sex. And when a woman is eating banana in her dream, and in some cases spiritually, and is having that kind of thing, the next thing that may occur in some women, it is it's time for masturbation, or it's time for me to go and have sex with my boyfriend, or it's time for me to go and have sex outside. Those are demonic thoughts. Those are thoughts that can, that can, that can tear your life to pieces. Well, when, when you are seeing banana in your dream, and it's not something that is bad, depending on how you have that dream. But when you are eating raw banana, be very, very mindful that your body chemistry is demanding for sex. It demanding for, this pushes you into fornication. But when you are a married man and you are dreaming about eating raw banana, and then uh, if you are eating raw, raw banana, then it tells you spiritually that, uh, that this is the time for you to impregnate your wife. But if you are a woman, we are eating banana in your dream, a raw banana, it tells you it can really trigger you into sexual immorality. So in this case, you have to control yourself, you have to control your mood, you have to control your hodge and all that, so that uh, it will not make you fall into sin. Praise the living Jesus. 
So when you are seeing rotten banana, in some cases, a banana in your dream also. A banana in the dream can also represent a male organ, a male organ, a male organ. So when you are seeing a rotten banana as a man, it's a bad signal. That is a weak erection. That means that you cannot impregnate a woman, a rotten banana. It means that you have a, you have a problem down there. A woman, when you are seeing a rotten banana, it shows that uh, there's something bad going on. A man is not, if you are married, it's my a man cannot satisfy you anymore. Or you, you cannot derive satisfaction from your man. And that if you are married, and that it can bring some serious issue in your marriage. And if you are not married, and you are having this kind of temptation and all that, please know and have it at the back of your mind that the devil is in the heart trying to do what? Trying to, trying to make you to fornicate. And you know, if you are a virgin woman who have been holding up for a long time and you are having even this kind of dream about eating banana or so, <laughs> no temptation, you have to hold yourself to the days of your marriage so that you will enjoy the glory of your marriage. Praise the living Jesus. When you are selling banana as a man, you are selling banana as a man, it means that you are really ready for sex. You are really ready to meet, to have a good relationship. You are really ready to satisfy your woman as a married person. Then if you are buying banana in the dream as a man, then it tells you that uh, you, are trying, you are trying to become a responsible man. You are trying to do something that will spice up your marriage. You are trying to do something that will make your woman or your wife to be happy of you. There are some people, the moment they got married in their waking life, that is when issues started. Issue will start, rather. The man will not be able to enjoy a wife, his wife. The woman will not be able to enjoy his wife. There will be a problem. So this dream, before you get married, is telling you that anything you have to do with sexual urge or something, you have to hold on to yourself to the days of your marriage. Praise the living Jesus. So when you are peeling banana, when you are peeling banana in the dream, you are peeling banana in the dream. That is not even a bad dream. It's not a bad dream. It's talking about that a man also is also ready to have sex. He's also ready. He's also ready to be fruitful. And a woman, a peeling banana, he say this can also be a time of his period or a time of his, of his of her ovulation. And a woman is peeling banana. As a married woman, it is saying that the man is ready to satisfy. But banana is something that has to do with emotion between a man and woman. I want to listen very carefully. And in some cases, to some people, when they are dreaming banana, in their own interpretation, it can also be masturbation. I've seen some number of reports about that. A, ma a woman dreaming about banana more frequent time, and before you, before you know it, she find herself masturbating. So when you are dreaming about banana, you have to start praying against temptation. You have to start praying against loss. You have to start praying against sexual immorality. You have to start praying against adultery. You have to start praying against anything that will corrupt your mind. Praise the living Jesus. So, in some cases, whereby you saw a ripe banana from the plant. You saw a ripe banana from the plant. If you are not married, it tells you that ripe banana you are seeing, it shows you that you are going to be fruitful in your marriage. As a man, and when you now plug it, if you are a married, you are a married person, you not plug it, it means you are going to get married to a, to a good person. A ripe banana, you plug it. It is you are going to get married to a good person, a fatter person. They are going to be a child for you, be a children for you. Praise the living Jesus. So maybe some case whereby someone is eating banana. Someone is eating banana. It's not even a bad dream. Someone is eating banana. You see, the person is trying, is trying, the person is trying to, to be responsible to his wife. When you are eating banana as a woman, it's trying to show that you are you are trying to sh tell yourself that you are ready for love. You are ready for love. That is what that dream indicates. When you are seeing bunches of banana, 
signify fruitfulness. That means the woman is going to bear children. The man is going, is going to be fertile man. Bunches of banana. You are going to prosper in your marriage. But when you are enjoying the smell, when, when you are feeling the smell of the banana, it means that smell represents problem in your marriage, represents problem in your relationship. That is carrying you away as a man and a woman. Maybe the man is not compatible. Maybe the man is not is is hiding something from you. Is is thinking is does not is not well dressed or the woman is like many many things acting up or something. It's smelling to you, so it does it does not in connection with what you are expecting of her of him. Praise the living Jesus. So before you get married, you have to pray. You have to pray for God to give you the right person for your marriage. And if you are married and your assistant is smelling. Is something that has to do with marital abuse, marital problem. Praise the living Jesus. When you are seeing bright banana, something something that has to do with marital blessings and love connections and getting married to a good person, then when you are seeing alright person, all right banana, it tells you that well, it's not yet time for you to get married. Alright banana, it's not it's not yet time for you to have sex with your wife, for you to have sex with your husband. It's not your time. God is telling you to do some certain things, do some certain th things, eat some certain things for you to become more fertile in your marriage. So when you are cutting banana in pieces, when you are cutting banana in pieces, that is not really a bad dream. That is a dream. That is a dream of progress. When you are peeling the banana, that banana peel you are peeling, you are trying to, you are trying to eat the sweetness of your marriage. The sweetness of your marriage. Those are the sweetness of your marriage. What is the sweetness of the marriage? It is children. You are peeling it for you to get to the deep side of that uh, banana, which is the children. Praise the living Jesus. So it means when you are peeling it, it means you are aiming at the fruitfulness of your marriage. Praise the living Jesus. When you are seeing banana tree in your house, it means no evil will come near your dwelling. Praise the living Jesus. So when you dream banana as a pregnant woman, it means you are going to have a successful delivering of that baby. Praise the living Jesus. When you are eating banana as a pregnant woman, it means you are going to have a successful delivering of that baby. Praise the living Jesus. So when you are eating banana and granite, when you are eating banana and granite, it, it tells you that at some point in time, you are going to face some, le some high level of frustration some high level of attack from the devil. But when you do not give up, when you are courageous, when you look unto God for your problem, the Lord will take you away from that problem. Eating banana and granite can bring a frustration to a man and a woman. But you, when you do not give up, at the end, you will testify. Praise the living Jesus. So in some cases whereby, when you step on a banana peel and fell, that banana peel you step upon, might not even be a trap of the enemy. That banana peel is something that has to do in your marriage. Something is falling you down as a man. Something is falling you down as a man. Whether your woman, whether your wife is not making you stand firm in your marriage. Maybe your husband is not making you stand firm in your marriage or in your relationship. You're not standing firm. Something is shifting you away. Your finances are not coming the way it comes. It's expected. You are losing away so many things. The, 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 the moment you begin to relate with this girl, with this man, you're not standing firm. Something is not wrong. That's the first signal that shows that the person you are dating is going to be a problem to you. You are standing you, on a panel pill and you are falling down and you are in a relationship. The one signal that that relationship will be a problem to you, whether a man or a woman. I want you to shout this prayer point loud and clear. Say, arrows! From the marine, arrows from the marine world against my marriage. Die, die, die in the name of Jesus. Die in the name of Jesus. What are the way out? The way out, give your life to Christ. Repent from your sin. Deal with your character. Deal with your attitude. Free from fornication and adultery. Seek God at all times and let him guide you. Ask the Holy Spirit to make you happy. Pray against Sota with the wrong people. What are the instructions? The instruction is to embark on 
three days fruits fasting, please. Three days fruits fasting. You are not going to break your fasting until 12 o'clock. You break the fasting through fruit, any fruit, fruit by 12 o'clock p.m. Close your eyes and take this prayer point loud and clear. Say, I bulldoze my way. I bulldoze my way to my marital breakthrough in the name of Jesus. I bulldoze my way to my marital breakthrough in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Say, every barren tree blowing problems against my destiny, die in the name of Jesus. Die in the name of Jesus. Every barren tree blowing problems against my destiny, die in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Say, any strong man eating the fruits of my marriage, the fruits of my relationship, die by fire, die by fire, die by fire, die by fire. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Say, any wicked power that have shut down the door of my victory against me, scatter in the name of Jesus. Scatter in the name of Jesus. Scatter in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Say, all evil spirits in the wind, hindering the move of my progress, scatter unto desolation. Scatter unto desolation. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. I want you to take this last prayer point loud and clear. Say, every damage done to my head in the dream, I recover it by fire. I recover it by fire. I recover it by fire. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. If this broadcast has blessed you, write your dream pointing to dream about banana, dream about plantain at the comment session. If this broadcast has blessed you and you wish to sow a seed, I'm on PayPal. You can sow a seed through my PayPal. My PayPal, my PayPal, go to my, my YouTube, a PayPal, support this ministry, and we are moving and moving higher, higher, and higher in Jesus' name. Once again, this is Evangelist Joshua, your school, your friend in the school of dream interpretation.